Hello my YouTube fans, it's your girl Kiana. If you are new here, welcome to my channel. If you have already been here and already a subscriber of mine, welcome back you guys and thanks for the support. So today, if you can see by the title, this is going to be a um, Christmas holiday dinner kind of lookbook. Um, items that you can wear to dinner, whether it's your fam with your family, whether it's um, going to your significant other's house or meeting his family for the first time, or either just um, type of, you know, going to a friend's house and y'all just kicking it with um, a few drinks and food. Um, just a few looks. It's going to be very short. Um, I'm not doing a whole drawn out um, lookbook this time. It's just probably going to be about three outfits. I may throw in a bonus outfit. I have to see what I have in my closet that does not need steaming because I'm kind of um, pressed for time right now. Um, I'm going to be stepping out in a little bit. So if you want to see what I put together, stay tuned for the video, you guys. Okay, you guys, so this is the first look. Um, now, this is more one of the casual looks. Um, it is a little bit dressed up, but I don't think it's um, kind of like overly dressed. So this is something that I would wear probably like to um, my auntie's house for Christmas, you know, just a regular family style dinner. Well, I want to be casual, we'll kind of lay back, but at the same time, I want to look cute. You know, maybe you want to stun on the cousins, you know. Um, I'm just kidding. I'm, I hope everyone is very close with their cousins. I know I am. But this is something that I will wear to, um, you know, family dinner at maybe your aunt's house or your uncle's house or cousin or whoever's um, hosting Christmas dinner for that year. This year, we will be going to my uncle's house. We normally do this every year. Um, since we lost our grandparents, so it used to be always hosted at uh, my grandparents' house. So this is what I would wear. Um, you know, you still want to look cute because maybe you and the cousins or, you know, the, yeah, yeah, maybe you and the cousins may want to go grab some drinks or so afterwards, after dinner, you know, just hang out, um, kind of refresh up on old times, just kicking it because you may have cousins that are here from out of town that you haven't seen. And quite a while so maybe throw on something still cute in case you decide to do something after Christmas dinner so that's what I have here um now you see this dress I got this from Zara I think it's very casual because if you notice the pockets makes it a very casual type look but I did throw this belt on um, with it now this is a kind of like blinged out type of belt on the buckle and I think that's very cute just give it to give this dress a little bit of pizzazz I think this is very cute again the dress is from Zara it is in a size 2x now I know Zara does not sell plus size clothing but you do have some of their pieces that do go up to 2x they have gotten a little bit better um, I remember last year when I was looking hardly anything went to a 2x but now um, as I've been looking more on Zara I noticed a lot of their pieces um, do go up to a 2x but a lot of them don't as well majority of them don't but you can kind of um, you know kind of drive through the website to see what you can find in a size 2x you can actually even put it in the filter box and it'll bring up all the items that go up to a size 2x so yes this is a 2x if you see this is a high low um, type of dress very very cute um, I did throw on a turtleneck. Let me come up a little bit closer so you can get a better look. I threw on a turtleneck underneath this to winterize it because if you do notice, these are um, three-quarter lengths, I think, um, sleeves. So, you know, if you're somewhere where the climate is very, very cold right about now, which it is very, very cold where I am, um, you do want to wear something under it so you won't <laughs> be freezing. So I just threw on this kind of thin weight um turtleneck that I got from H&M. Both of these items were just recently hauled, so um, you probably can still find them on the Zara site as well as the H&M site. The turtleneck was no more than $12.99. Um, this dress was on sale for $24.99 on the Black Friday, Cyber Monday sale. The belt was from Mad Rag. I um, hauled this a couple of videos ago. No more than $10. And you guys, I threw it on with these Just Fab boots. Now, I've had these boots since the, since the beginning of the season. Um, you did see these in my boot haul, my um, fall, winter boot haul. Um, I'm pretty I'm not sure they still have them. I'm not going to lie. They have them on 
just fab and they have them on shoe dazzle but they are sold out in most of the colors as well as most sizes you may luck up i'm not sure if they have restocked in the last two weeks or so but two weeks ago when i went on to look at these again because i wanted to get them in the burgundy color they were all sold out but if you can see this has a three and a half to four inch heel but the heel is very very comfortable you guys because it is a one of the stock chunkier heels now also if you can see not sure if you can see you guys um I'm, I'm looking in a very small viewfinder and the way my eyes are set up honey but these are um the very popular um kind of square toe heel um so that's very stylish but this is very cute i think it's very very cute um being as though you have this kind of statement um belt i probably wouldn't overdo it with the accessories i'm not wearing any accessories right now in this video because i just did not feel like getting anything out but i will wear probably a very thin silver necklace with this um you can throw on a silver watch if you are going to wear earrings i would say something small like this like i have on gold right now because i barely take these off um but of course i wouldn't wear go with this i will wear silver just because of the belt um loops but i would wear a smaller um kind of stud maybe diamond or even a very um small silver hoop like i'm wearing today um and you know my hair is natural i just try to do something with it but you know with me having the the, the clips in my hair with this um i don't want bulky jewelry to clash with what i'm wearing Okay, guys, this is the outfit. Tell me what you think. Okay, so this outfit is another laid-back outfit. This is an outfit that I would wear if I was hosting dinner at my home. Um, you know, normally when you're cooking... You like to be as comfortable as possible. A lot of times you're so tired where you don't even feel like trying to put an outfit together. So you go to the most effortless pieces that you have in your closet. And I did so today. If you can see, I'm just wearing a sweatshirt. This is a lightweight sweatshirt, you guys, that I picked up from Target last year. Um, no more. I think this was maybe on sale for $10. Um, but you can get these type of sweatshirts anywhere. So you see I have a half tuck. That's um, how I like to wear most of my sweaters or sweatshirts um, kind of tucked in. You can have it fully, um, well, you know, you can have it tucked in the middle. You can have it tucked on the side, however you may like it. I paired it with my Gucci belt just to kind of um, hold my waist in because these are um, a, a tad bit big in the waist. Um, I did pick these jeans up. These are Fashion Nova jeans. And I picked these jeans up, you guys, um, from Fashion Nova um, during the Black Friday sale. I just hauled these, so I'm pretty sure they may still have them. not sure because this is the week before Christmas, and the stores, I'm pretty sure, is out of control. But um, you did see me haul these just two videos ago, you guys. So um, I paired them with these red booties here. Um, I hope you can see them well. I picked these up from Target last year you guys they are a pointy toe boot um so which is very classic i think pointy toe um, won't be going out of style anytime soon excuse me sorry about that you guys my phone was ringing i had to take that call but um pointy toe boots i just really feel as though it's going to be around forever and forever it's a classic style um they just look so classy they round the outfit out very very well um but you know um everybody doesn't like to wear heels in their living room this is just an outfit i paired it with heels because this is um the type of outfit where you still kind of want to look want to look cute because you're not sure um who if who all is going to come to dinner you know you invited your family but maybe you invited a co-worker you know this time of year you tend to invite um other people that you might have you know friends or people that you may have a, a, a good relationship with at work you know you have people who don't have that whole big family or family oriented um life so you know you tend to invite others to dinner so that's when you might want to say okay 
I, I normally am in a sweatshirt or a sweater and my slippers, but today I want to kind of look well put together because my co-worker is coming over or my good, good girlfriend is coming over, so let me throw something on. So that's when I would throw on the heels and kind of make it look very festive, well put together, looking pretty good. But if it was just family over, you guys, I wouldn't even go through the hassle. Excuse me, guys. I wouldn't go through the hassle of throwing on a heel or anything. I would probably have on this whole outfit that I have on now. But, hold on a minute. I would probably pair it with these flats here. Um, very, very comfortable. Even, and, you know, this is still to kind of round out your outfit. But you don't even have to do that. You probably, you know, you cook. You've been up all night cooking. You've been slaving over the stove. Over the stove. You might just want to have on your slippers, girlfriend. But, um... I like to still, you know, look put together when I'm having company at the house. So I would probably do this, these, if it's just um, my immediate family coming over for dinner. So this next outfit, I'm getting into the more, um, not formal, but more of classier, more dressed up type of wear. Now this outfit here, this is something that I would wear if I was going to um, my significance of the house, um, someone I have been dating. For a while, I have not yet met their family, and this will be my first time meeting them. So, when that happens, you kind of want to be a little more dressed up, even if it's just a kind of casual um, dinner. Um, it's their casual dinner, but this is your first time meeting them, so you kind of want to make a good impression. You want to look like you did come from a good family, <laughs> you know. Um, most of us probably did come from a good family, but, you know, either or, you want to look like you are well put together. Um, so this is something that I would wear, being as though um, the boyfriend may have said, oh, it's just a casual dinner, my moms and my cousins and aunts and uncles will probably be over. Even though they might be in sweatpants and sweatshirts, you want to be a little more dressier just because first impressions do count. <laughs> I'm telling you, first impressions really do count. You don't want to go to someone's family um, member's house, um, your, your significant other's family member's house for the first time and you have all your assets out. I mean, far as low cut blouses and um, dresses or skirts that are uh, minis, you don't kind of want to be like that. So I would do this. Now this is just a silk blouse. This blouse I got from the thrift store, you guys. Um, I hauled it quite a bit ago. Um, but yes, very cute blouse is in a kind of champagne color, so it is in that kind of festive color, so you are looking like, you know, you're in a holiday spirit. This is a peplum style shirt, so I love this because it comes in at the waist, it's a situation waist a little bit, um, if you can see even at the back. Y'all, I'm so proud because just, when I did this haul a few months ago, I could not get into this shirt. I mean, it was so tight, I felt like I was busting out of it. Um, now, it's still a little tight on the arms, but it fits my shabbat, so that's telling me that your girl lives in a little bit of weight. Yes. Um, but let's get back to the video. I have on these jeans. I hauled these jeans just recently from, um, Fashion Nova. Um, so these are just a pair of black trouser style jeans. They're very, very long. If you can see, they look more of, um, a trouser. They look more like trousers. But they are a jean material, um, so much that they still the, the, they still mimic their trouser style with how it has the flop over for the fastening. You guys, these fit very nicely. They are fitted, but I don't think they're too tight where they look like hoochie mama thigh. No. Um, so I do have on a pair of pumps. You can't see them too well because I have on the jeans are so long. But these are a pair of just kitten pumps, kitten heel pumps that I also picked up from the thrift store in the summertime, you guys. Okay, you guys, so this is my last outfit, and if you can see, this is more of a formal type look, you guys. Very, very formal formal um, type of, I'm not going to even say like even, I won't wear this to a ball, but this is more for a formal type of um, dinner. Like, I'm, I must say, you don't have to just wear this to your significant others house it could be if your family member your family i'm sorry if you're not a family member but if your family has decided to you know um do something more formal this year i must say that my husband family does things like that they normally run out halls um and maybe have someone cater 
their um, family events, rather. Sometimes they do it on Thanksgiving, sometimes they do it on Christmas. Um, they, when the man and him first got together, they had did one that was at one of the local um, halls here in the area, and it was a very nice establishment. Um, they had people service and things like that. Um, so some families do that. Some families put together some money, decide that they want to cater um, the event or have it somewhere fancy other than um, having just one person or a couple of people um, make dishes. So it just depends, you know, whether it's your family, whether it's your significant other's family. It doesn't have to be you meeting your, your significant other for the first time. It just depends on the type of dinner um, you're going to. So this is more formal. Um, um, you look more classy, well-rounded, well, you know, nice. You just look nice. You know, so this is that outfit. I did wear this last week to my um, office um, Christmas luncheon. And I got so many compliments. Everyone told me I looked so nice. This is a very classic um, Christmas type style. You see I have on this chunky sweater. I got this sweater from H&M. I just hauled this during my cyber um, Monday haul as well. So you just seen me with this um, sweater picking up this sweater. Um, if you can see, it has the whole pearl embellishment, pearl and gold embellishment down the neck, and that's what makes it more classy, more dressed up, because um, if it didn't have that, this would just be a basic sweater. Now, this sweater, you guys, is um, kind of a crop length. Um, it's not like that hoochie mama, um, young girl type of crop. It's, it's like a crop that fits you right at the belt line, but of course, I would tuck it in or kind of Flip it over like that so you can see more of the skirt. This skirt, I also got it from H&M. Now, this skirt is like a champagne color that matches perfectly with this cream sweater. I got this um, skirt from H&M um, a, a while ago, maybe about a month, a month and a half, well, about a month and a half to two months ago. Um, I also paired it with these snakeskin booties that I have here. Um, if you watch my um, videos, you know that I hold these and my whole fall slash winter boot haul that was on my channel quite a while ago. But these are those boots. If you can see, the heel is a short heel. This is only about a three inch heel. It is a cone heel, so it's very, very comfortable. This is about the comfortable to, mm, the most comfortable. I'm sorry, y'all, I'm tongue tied. These are the most comfortable boots that I own. These are boots that I will wear if I know I'm gonna, gonna be going out to the club with the girls. Well, I know I'm going to be standing all night. I would definitely wear these boots. They are so, so comfortable. They are knee-high boots, so they don't come over the knee. They come just to the knee. They are from Eloquy. Um, not sure if they sold out because these have been on Eloquy since the fall. They may still have them. They may still curry them. If they do, I will link it below. Um, so, yes, this outfit is very, very cute. I got so many, so many com compliments off of this outfit. Now, you know that satin is that whole thing for like Christmas during the festive months. Christmas, Thanksgiving, um, New Year's. Um, your, your, the fabrics that people wear most are silk and satin and sequins. Now, I'm not a sequins type girl, but give me a silk and satin piece all day long. Your girl is going to rock it. But you do know that silk can be um, a little unflattering at times, so you do have to wear the appropriate items underneath of your silk. Now today, this is just a try on. I'm in my basement. I'm not going out anywhere. So I don't have on any shapewear, but when I did wear it to my luncheon last week, I did have on shapewear, so it was holding me in. It was smoothing everything, um, so everything around my hips, around my stomach. Um, so you didn't couldn't see any um, indentations from like cellulite or anything. Um, but I'm not sure how it looks now, but I had the appropriate undergarments under this. You do want to wear the appropriate undergarments. Um, some satins, if they are a thinner satin, will stick to you and hold a lot of static. This is more of a thicker, um, it's not real thick, but it is a thicker kind of satin. So it's not clinging to me like some of the satin skirts that I have um, will do. But to kind of combat that for those um, items that are a thinner satin or silk, just put a slip underneath and make sure it's not a slip that have kind of like lines or lace in it because you will see that lace pattern through the silk. So make sure it's just a 
all around um, either satin or um, polyester straight line um, kind of slip where you won't be able to see any lumps or anything in that slip. Um, but yes, that's the appropriate way to wear um, silk or satin items because they can um, be unflattering at times. You just have to know how to wear it to get that good look. Um, but this is the outfit. So classy. I feel like such a lady in this outfit. I feel so feminine. I just feel good in this outfit. Um, when I went to that luncheon, you know, um, your girl walked in like she owned the spot. You know, I just it just gives satin sometimes give you a whole sophisticated kind of wealthy type of look. Um, even though you might don't got two pennies to rub together, um, but you still give that illusion like, okay, I got everything together. Even though your girl is broke right about now, Christmas has worn me out. <laughs> All of these grandbabies, these kids need to stop having children. I'm not ready. Um, yes. <laughs> so this is um, my look, you guys. So I would like for everyone to leave me comments. Let me know what you will be doing for this Christmas and New Year's festive season. Um, will you be eating dinner, whether you're meeting your boyfriend's family? Um, let me know what you're going to be doing. Okay, so that brings me to the end of the lookbook. Um, I hope you guys got inspired by some of the looks that I put together. Always remember, um, everybody is not going to have the same items in their wardrobe. This is not to tell you to go out and buy the pieces that... Um, I have shown you today. Find things in your closet that's similar. You know, um, some of the skirts that I, um, put, one of the skirts I had on was a midi skirt. It doesn't have to be a silk midi skirt. It doesn't have to be, um, it really doesn't even have to be a midi. It can be a mini. It's just about how you incorporate the look and items that you put in to your look to make it your own. Um, I was just trying to give you examples of things that um, you could wear to um, Christmas dinner, you guys. So I hope everyone loved the video. If you haven't subscribed, please do so on the link below. Also, turn on your notifications, you guys, so you can be notified of any up and coming videos that your girl may make. Um, this is going to be it. Um, this is going to be the last video, you guys, until the new year. But hopefully, um, during the, at the beginning of the year, I can roll out more than one video a week. Maybe I can do two a week. We're going to see how that goes. All right, my loves, happy holidays. Enjoy your Christmas and your New Year's.